First, you're going to want to navigate to your local app data folder. You need that by pressing the Windows key and R at the same time. Doing so will open this little box in the bottom left of your screen. And from there, type in percent local app data percent and press enter. Then in this folder, look for PAL, saved, save games, and your Steam ID. Here are all of your saves in both single player and multiplayer. Now we will need to find our save that we want to move over. We can do this easily by simply opening the game, loading up our designated save, moving around a little bit, and then leaving while saving. Now in our folder, we'll look for the folder that has been modified within the last few minutes. Now we want to right click on this folder and save it as a zip file. Heading back over to the control panel, we want to make sure our server is offline. And then in the file manager, navigate to L, saved, save games, zero. And here will be our current server's save. We're going to need the name of it, so open rename and copy the name of the folder. Then we will simply upload our zipped single player save into this directory. Once it is uploaded, click the little meatball menu and extract the zip. Give it a refresh and you will now see the saved folder right there. We can now safely delete the zip file. Now we'll delete the server's save file and rename our uploaded save file to the name that we copied earlier, that being the server's save file that we just deleted. Essentially, we're just swapping it in place of the servers. Finally, just head back to the console and start up your server. You should now be loaded into your transferred save. Now we're going on to the second half of this video. This is if you want to download your server save and run it locally in single player. First, we'll just head over to our control panel, make sure the server is off, and then in the file manager, navigate to how saved, save games, zero. And then we'll click the meatball menu and click on archive and download this as a zip. Then you can delete the zip from your server once it's downloaded to your computer. Now we'll open our local PAL world data folder by again, pressing Windows and R, typing in percent local app data percent and pressing enter. Then we'll go to PAL, saved, save games and your Steam ID. And now we will unzip our downloaded save and move the unzipped folder into our local saves folder. Then just boot up the game, click on the top result, and you have now transferred your save to your computer.